Hey class, this is Mr. Corsi. Today we're going to talk about the auto-tune feature in GarageBand 10. It's really easy, especially if you're a horrible singer like me, so you can make it sound similar to the way it sounds professionally. So let's take a look. Now I already pre-recorded a little bit of myself here, so let's take a look at how terrible it sounds. Hello, my name is Mr. Corsi. Welcome to Mr. Corsi's classroom. Thank you all for watching. That was terrible. So let's add auto tune. The first thing you need to do is go to editors and under track you increase the pitch to 100 and then choose limit to key. Let's preview what it sounds like. Hello, my name is Mr. Corsi. Welcome to Mr. Corsi's classroom. Thank you all for watching. That was a little bit better, but if you actually have a good singing voice, it will definitely improve. One thing to keep in mind is you need to really set what key you're trying to sing in. I chose A minor. Choose that before you record. That is how easy it is to add auto-tune to your voice. Now if you want to add like a duet sound, you could even copy and paste. And then I could play this. Mr. Corsi's Classroom. Thank you all for watching. You can do the different uh, vocal effects and copy your sound so it sounds like a bunch of different people. So there's a lot of cool things you can do in GarageBand 10. So have fun. Thank you all for watching. Hey class, if you like this video, please click like below and subscribe to this channel. Also, like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter.